What is going on today, everybody? Welcome back to Fix It Garage. And another letdown. I was hoping to once again bring you guys the new secret project, but there have been some extended delays on that project. More on that at the end of the video. Today's video, we're actually gonna be doing something a little different. Instead of wrenching on cars like we normally would, it's time to uh, say goodbye to a car that is a part of the Fix-It Garage fleet. And no, it is not the Subaru, although there is some changes coming to that. It's not our truck and it's not the CRV. As all of you guys know, my good friend Bob has been around helping out with the channel for quite a while now. Um, you might recognize his BRZ from multiple videos that he's been in, both working on his car or him driving his car, and it's kind of become a part of the channel. Well, he sold it. He has gotten rid of the blue BRZ, and he's getting something different. Now, we're not going to talk about the car that he's getting. That's going to be for a future video. But today we're going to take a little bit of time and we're going to reminisce on Bob's BRZ. I've created a little montage of clips. I hope that you guys enjoy seeing his BRZ through different things that we have done to it. Without further ado, we are here to say goodbye to Bob's BRZ.
Uh, the, that, that's very, 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 very good. Um, And with that, we can finally say goodbye to the BRZ, and we will be saying hello to the new project car here very soon. But you guys are gonna have to wait for that video for just a little bit. Um, I personally really enjoyed that car. Uh, he let me drive it quite a few times, and it was a really fun experience. Um, BRZs are great cars for anyone who wants to get an autocross, by the way. They are like the perfect starter autocross car in my mind. They're very easy to drive and you can get all the parts and get them from street to street touring relatively easily. So just a little side note, but it was a great car, but I understand he wants to move on to something different and, you know, try something new. Try to develop a different chassis than doing a BRZ. So we will obviously have that new car on the channel. We'll be featuring it like crazy, but I just wanted to kind of say goodbye to the BRZ. It was a fun car. I hope you guys enjoyed that little montage. Um, it's been a few, it's been an interesting few years with that car and I'm definitely going to miss it. Uh, it was a cool addition to have into our, our fix it garage fleet, but now we get to welcome a new car. So I'm very excited for that, but that is going to do it for today. Everybody. I want to thank all of you guys for watching. If you like what you saw, smash the like button, show some support for Bob and his old car and let's get hyped up for the next one. It's not going to be something that you expect to be coming to this channel. Another weird car that we've never worked on that's coming to the channel. I, I know, I must be crazy. But make sure you guys smash that like button. Leave your, uh, com leave your comments down below and subscribe so you guys don't miss the new project when it comes to the channel, hopefully soon. Um, speaking of projects, I guess I should talk about that secret project. So, the secret project has been delayed because we are waiting for a very big part that completely holds up the project and I really, really, really don't wanna publish any of these videos of this new project until I know I can finish it because I don't wanna get three videos in or whatever and then not be able to finish it. That's not fair to you guys, that's not fair to the project. I want this project to be seen all videos in a row, like no gaps because that's what this thing deserves. This is the most ambitious thing I have ever done. But just for you guys, if you made it this far in the video, I'll give you another little sneak peek. That's all you guys get. Thank you for watching. I'll catch you in the next video. Bye-bye.